in spending between Merrimack Valley um, Co-op and the Kearsage Co-op is $4,000 a child. Um, in a typical classroom, as Ms. Ian mentioned, of 25 kids, that's a difference of $100,000 in spending on a child's education in the same state within miles of each other. That's not right. 72% of our school funding comes from the local property tax. So I don't blame the people of Webster, the people who are in the Merrimack Valley School District. They can't afford, they can't afford to spend the money and that's a travesty and that's why children are missing out. Some of you may know that I still practice law. I do cases in Georgia, a really forward-thinking state that has universal pre-K. We need to have universal pre-K. We have to develop the community colleges so that there are programs that are for free. We have a nursing shortage. We have childcare workers in the state that aren't well paid and they still have to pay college tuition to get their associate's degrees. We ought to encourage, encourage people into those programs and make it easier for younger families to work in this state by making childcare more affordable. And finally, my wife Amy, who's here, and I are both first-generation college students who went on to become lawyers. We understand how difficult it is to live with college and law school debt. And New Hampshire's got the highest debt load per student of any state in the nation. And that's because we saddle poor families with a double whammy of high property taxes and high college tuitions. And we need to address both. Thank you, Mr. Wilkinski. Um, so